Spending cash may be going out of style. A new study found just 9% of people use paper money as their preferred way to pay. Most folks choose debit or credit cards. And now one Austin restaurant plans to stop letting customers pay with cash. KXAN's Alicia Enns explains. Hey, how's it going, Greg? Lunchtime at Cilantro Barbecue in Austin can be summed up in two words. Kimchi fries. And we go through hundreds of thousands of fries a year. It's the most popular item on the menu, but in just weeks, what you'll no longer find, cash. The restaurant has slowly been phasing it out, and at the food truck location, it's been credit card only for the past two months. Owner Jay Kim says most of his customers were already pulling out the plastic. 85% of our customer base are willing to spend, spend their money with their credit cards. Customer convenience may be one thing, peace of mind, is another. We don't have to worry about thefts, somebody coming into our restaurant and wanting to steal cash. And our staff are not tempted to, to steal. But mixing up the way you pay comes with mixed reviews. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm happy with the direction societally this is signaling. Well, I don't mind at all. I only mostly use card anyway. For Cilantro, cash is no longer king. They're putting faith in the change. And it may hurt our business in the beginning, uh, but we think that in the long term, it's, it, it'll really benefit everybody. Alicia Inns, KXAN News. Jalantro says they will make the official switch to cashless, cashless sometime in mid-April. And cutting out cash could also help customers save money. A Tufts University study found Americans lose a half a billion dollars every year from criminals stealing cash. But the biggest cost comes from the fees you pay to get cash. Each year, those charges cost American consumers nearly $8 billion.